Hello guys, welcome to BTEX Park. Now, in this video, I would like to explain you how to run a Streamlit app on Google Colab or how to launch a Streamlit app from Google Colab. That I'll explain you in this video. For that, first we need to install the Streamlit. For installing Streamlit library, you can type this pip install Streamlit. Let's say I am not expecting a clumsy of output. I just want a final output. So that's why I am putting this hyphen Q. It's same like in a quit mode, I am installing this Streamlit. Now my Streamlit got installed successfully. Now let's create a Streamlit example app to print a welcome or you can say hello world for that i am writing first i am importing this uh, streamlit as st and i am using that uh, st dot write for writing hello world this will tell hello world so whenever this is streamlit app got run first i want to save this app in here as a app.py file for that we have this uh, magic commands in google colab that is a uh, you can type this uh, two times so that you can able to get these magic commands write file app.py uh, if I execute this, then a app.py file will created with this commands. Now I'm running this. Yeah, so writing got done. I'm just refreshing it. You can see this app.py file got created with the commands, whatever I provided below it. Okay. Now our app is ready. Now to solve this Streamlit app, let's install some local tunnel. To launch or to install this local tunnel, you can use the command that is npm install local tunnel. So I'm just running this so that this tunnel will get installed. Yeah, now this got installed successfully. You can see these two files got added additionally and this node module is also added additionally now let's run the streamlit app in background and save the ip addresses in logs file logs.txt for that you can write this streamlit run app.py this command actually used to run this app.py file and what i'm expecting i want to save the logs in logs.txt for that not logs you can say the server related ip addresses for that you can use this uh, content logs.txt now i am running this so that our streamlit app got run successfully and you can see this logs.txt file also got created successfully through this as a local host if you want to access this is the local host address url whereas uh, through network url if you want to access this is a network related ip address whereas the hosted instance related ip address is this you can use this ip address in future in order to access our streamlit app through tunnel now since i already installed this tunnel i want to expose this streamlit app whatever the streamlit app i'm running now through that tunnel through on port 8501 for that exposing of our streamlit app that is running streamlit app on our tunnel that is a local tunnel port 8501 we need to use the command that is npx local tunnel and we need to specify the port that is 8501 so that's it so that uh, it will provide us this uh, url 
now i'm just opening this by just clicking on it so you can see that yeah you just opened uh, the tunnel related commands okay missing port so i need to specify the port name correctly yeah if we do some mistakes uh, like this then we'll get that uh, website for correctly running this now you can see we got uh, our url where the tunnel or you can say our streamlit app is hosted on top of this host through this tunnel now in order to access our streamlit app through this tunnel we need to open this url then after opening this url it will ask you the tunnel password this tunnel password is nothing but our ip address so that is this i'm just copying this ip address not port number only the ip address external url ip address and paste that and you can click on submit so that uh, your streamlit app that is hosted streamlit app will be visible here since i written code for hello world i am expecting hello world related you can see message now i got that hello world related message that means from where i hosted this uh, streamlit app i hosted this streamlit app in this collab google collab and how do i expose it that through to internet by using this local tunnel port 8501 and so if we recap we just installed the streamlit and we have written the app.py file in our uh, google collab and that file contains our streamlit app code to run this streamlit app we return this streamlit run app.py and taken the ip address or inside this logs.txt then in order to expose this to internet we just install this uh, local tunnel by using this npm install command then we exposed this by using this uh, npx local tunnel with port 8501 then we used this url in order to access our app hosted streamlit app for accessing that we even provided the password as our external url related port number that is this as the ip address through that we accessed our streamlit website and you can see we got the message if i rerun it as well then then also i can able to get the same thing so that's that's about this video we have successfully launched our streamlit app using google collab by using local tunnel